Trinity United Methodist is Lafayette's oldest church dating to before the city was even founded. One of the prominent features of the church is its 36 stained glass windows. Trinity is a historic church and um, the windows are an incredible uh, resource for us, an incredible piece of beauty and art. And uh, over the years, like everything else, they have become worn. Sometime in the 1960s, for good reasons, a protective glass covering was placed, had ripples in the glass. Uh, and throughout the years, unfortunately, that meant there was no maintenance, painting, or repair of the woodwork or of the windows. Trinity is listed on the National Register of Historic Places. That designation allowed the church to apply for a grant from the Indiana Department of Natural Resources. We're restoring all the windows in four phases, uh, one side of the church per year. And uh, that uh, resulted in a grant application for $50,000 to be matched by at least $40,000 from the church. Yeah, it is an expensive project. That's why we do it one phase at a time, just as we did with the bricks, one side of the building at a time. The project will not only be expensive, but also time consuming. The stained glass windows will actually be removed and they'll either be uh, repaired, which will be laying them on a surface, strengthening portions, straightening out some, filling in where the lead has broken, or actually in some cases restored, which means taking them entirely apart, basically rebuilding them with the same pieces of glass. The windows were created 100 years ago by local artist Edna Browning Ruby, who was a longtime member of Trinity, and at the time, the only woman in the country working in stained glass. So it's fitting that the restoration work will be done locally too. There's at least one local uh, establishment that we think can do the work and do it quite well. The project has generated support not just from the congregation, but from the community in general. Pastor Leslie says anyone can donate to the window restoration. They can go to our church's website and go to that historic preservation page, and uh, they can learn more about this project and contribute via the website to this project. Visitors to trinitylafayette.org will find a complete history of the church and a detailed explanation of the restoration process. Once completed, the windows will be more visible and closer to their original appearance 100 years ago. To see the intricate detail and colors and the choice of the also almost Art Nouveau colors uh, in these windows, it to me has always been inspirational. So I would love to see them back to their original glory. We host a lot of programs here. We host community organizations. We have a lot of events out on our lawn. And uh, so it is important that the church is a place that, is, uh, that looks welcoming and hospitable, not only for our congregants, but also for our community as a resource for the whole community. Trinity United Methodist Church is located at 6th and North Streets with services Sunday mornings at 1030. Dave North, Star City News, downtown Lafayette.